Hey everyone, CT and Technology News here, and today I'm doing a rumor video on the upcoming Google smartphone, which could be named the Nexus 6 if it has a 6-inch screen, or the Nexus 5 II if Google decides to keep the screen size the same. Now, the Nexus 5 was admittedly only released in November, but people were already starting to look ahead to Google's next smartphone, which they might already be considering about working on. Now, the Nexus 4 and Nexus 5 have gone down well as great value for money devices, with prices starting at $350 which is much lower than the likes of the iPhone, despite still packing in some powerful specs. If they follow this trend, then we can expect a similar, very cheap Nexus 6 from Google. Now, not much is known about the next Nexus device, but the rumors so far that it will come with a 4K display panel stretching a comfortable 5.3 to 5.7 inches. It would be between 5 and 6 inches, which would be the biggest smartphone yet from Google, but it wouldn't be quite getting into the really extra large phablet territory. Now, other rumors point to an 18 megapixel camera on the rear and a 4 megapixel camera on the front, fingerprint scanners on the device, and a sleek metallic body, much like the upcoming Galaxy S5. Now, the Nexus 6 is also expected to be powered by a 64 bit quad core Snapdragon CPU, although the exact processor hasn't been confirmed yet. Now, we've seen a whole bunch of concepts for the upcoming Nexus 6. None of them seem to show a device that's actually, that actually would actually exist. They seem to be showing more far out designs for the Nexus 6. But with that said, maybe Google will do something unexpected with the design for the Nexus 6 and make it extremely sleek, or just do something unusual like LG did with the G2 and put the buttons on the back. Now, it's not really clear whether Google will also collaborate with LG on the upcoming Nexus 6, as they've done for the Nexus 5 and the Nexus 4. They might possibly con collaborate with Samsung or Lenovo or another Android phone maker, although LG does seem like a pretty likely candidate because they've done a really good job with uh, Google's last two smartphones. Now, there's also talk that Google might shift away from its Nexus devices altogether and just move into just releasing Google Play Edition handsets, but I really think this would be a pity. For one thing, Google has spent years building up the Nexus brand and it's become very well trusted and very reliable and also known for being pretty cheap. As smartphones go. I personally really like the Nexus brand, and I would be really sorry to see it go in favor of Google Play Edition handsets, which often are more unwieldy and aren't quite so well designed in general. But let me know what you'd like to see in an upcoming Nexus 6 or Nexus 5 II in the comments below. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time. Bye!